The water here, crystal clear. Kind of interesting to see water that clear here. Already see a ton of fish swimming and moving. Kind of look like what I got on. So just going to go ahead and launch out and see. Thing about this place though guys it has um has a ton of bass in it but it also has like chain pickerel and like other species too so that's why that's a bite that's a bite that's what i was trying to tell y'all it's got some other species in here too Y'all know what it is. Look at that right there. On that Wu Tungsten, you guys can see that clear as day, that Wu Tungsten popped them. Pitched it next to a piece of wood over there. And if you catch a good fish, you gotta get a little idea of what you're, what you're doing out here. So I'm gonna let this thing get set. All right, should be set. Let's get an idea of what we're working with here. Two pounder. Let's go guys, a two pounder. Knew it felt good when he took off. So, fish number one out here, guys. Pitch it next to a piece of wood. Just bit it as soon as it hit. I'm gonna go ahead and let him go. He's in there and swam away. Easy. Okay, guys, that's on that. I fish this all the time, and I tell you guys about it every time I fish it, but I don't think I actually pulled it out of the package, so. That's on the Gambler Lures. Why not, guys? I just got a Texas rig. Normally, I, I fish it as a jig trailer. Um, but I do love it lately as a Texas rig. All right, guys. So that's fish number one out here. Guys, I really wanted to stick with today just throwing a jerk bait, but... That's another one. I don't feel it. Oh my God. That's another one. And another one following it. That's way bigger than it. This is another one. He had it for a while too and I couldn't, I couldn't yank on him. I should be able to just pop it out. I heard another one, guys. And there was two more following him that were bigger. Way bigger than him. This is another one. Wish I could clean them off a little bit. There's some, some crazy stuff in here that uh, be trying to eat these suckers. Same bait, guys. Texas rig again. Another two pounder. Two pounder again, guys. Honestly, I'll take this every day of a tournament, guys. If I can catch two pounders on a Texas rig all day, let him go, swam away. Hopefully, he brings his friends back. Glad he swam away good guys he had he had put the hook down there um pretty far you know what i'm just gonna go straight out because i'm not sure where those fish went to that's the thing guys i saw my lines i saw my line take off but i never actually felt that i had a fish on there i just was I honestly had started looking at two other fish that were swimming right in front of me that were freaking huge. And come
Alright right, guys, so I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video there. Just wanted to do a quick little pond hopping video for you guys. Fall, fi uh, fall fishing. It's been pretty fun here as of lately. I had a good time, managed to get on a couple of good fish here at the pond. Um, a couple more I wish I had gotten, like I said, one, I don't know if I explained in the video, one was almost twice as big as the one I actually caught, was chasing the one, or maybe hanging out, maybe they were friends, I'm not sure what it was, but they were hanging out, these two fish, and another fish swam up in the same group, and I believe there was more past it, I just got really locked in on that huge one, um, and I caught the one that was right beside it. So, hope you guys enjoy a little pond hopping, I encourage you all to get out and enjoy. I know it's cold in the morning, but if you go out around four three or four in the afternoon you probably going to get on some pretty good fish here until it gets really really cold then you really got to be strategic on when you actually uh, go out to the water so uh, with that being said hope you guys enjoy and i wanted to introduce you guys to the newest member of our family here hopefully you guys can see he cannot see you as of right now he is currently sleeping but this is our newest addition here tiny baby Baby number four, guys. Very excited and very thankful for him. He's a healthy, healthy baby boy who is absolutely perfect. So I wanted to introduce you guys to him for a couple seconds. Um, I don't want to disturb his sleep. And he has not started practicing fishing yet. He's still getting the hang of eating, sleeping, and using the bathroom at this time. That's about the extent of what he's doing. But he will be at some point, guys. He will be fishing. Most likely just going to be coming out with daddy and mommy and doing the wonderful outside and stuff but appreciate you guys who subscribe to the channel make sure you hit that like button below subscribe um, if you haven't already uh, got some more videos coming some great things queued up and ready to go for you guys here i'm um, probably be doing some more tips and tricks and then talking to you guys guys about getting ready for the big bass tour which is coming up next year a couple of us are going down there it's going to be a lot of fun on smith mountain lake the same lake i caught my pb at last year hopefully this time i catch it in the tournament not the day before Thanks for tuning in. You guys are awesome. As always, peace. I'm out. Me and the, me and the baby. We're out.